Hello, my lovelies! Sigita Visa Journal with a large one, with a like big uh, um, uh, project. And this time it did take me a little bit, it did take me a while because it's different format uh, from very beginning. I could not start that journal because uh, it was different. Actually, when you cha uh, change uh, journal size, it does make difference. And this uh, a kind of journal I haven't made before, and I just wanted to try. And and yeah, actually, at the end, it just get faster, and I have finished it. <laughs> um, most of it is on a Patreon. A Patreon quickly, maybe who are new ones. I uh, most of my tutorials and videos are on Patreon, and that's a monthly pay, right? So it's not payment for one video or or one tutorial. It's monthly payment. Uh, you can stay for a month or two are free and watch through all videos. Uh, because I think there's a lot of videos, like over hundred videos. Right, so, and uh, another thing, on Instagram, if you follow me on Instagram as well, I am more on Instagram, and yeah, so let's, let's start, let's start. I did make some tassel as well, I'm not making really tassel, but this time I did, with like rusted, uh, rusted uh, ribbon. And just cotton ribbons and some beads and a little bit of uh, dyed fabric as well. So that's uh, can take it off. I made this part a little bit bigger uh, on purpose, longer on purpose to put that to attach that um, tassel cover itself. So our journal goes landscape, right? Is not a uh, portrait style it is landscape so that's what was uh, you know a little bit tricky for me journal is big uh it is 10 by seven and a half and spine is let's say one and a half spine one signature but it's quite full signature cover itself is painted is matte only I put a little bit of glue on this rabbit and Alice and teacup just you know to be make sure they are safe <laughs> and some embellishments and stitching this metallic uh, button it was actually uh, silver so I put on alcoholic ink and that way I got this lovely grungy uh, button. It's not coming off because it's, because it's, um, it's alcoholic ink. Right, on the back, back as well, very simple. This is all matte, is all painted. And a shop, my shop name is sprayed with a clear varnish coat. But anyway, please don't wash. <laughs> please keep away from water, as you know, all of journals. Right, so let's get through. And this time I made like that closure, just little loop, right? Just goes over. Uh, I wanted to make some bow here, but then that bow covered Alice. So I was like, no, this time I wanted all that cover to be open. So that's why I made that. It's stitched in. And right, so here we go. Uh, shall I just start from one side? I have to move, otherwise it won't get in. Right, inside of the cover, as always, I'm untouching little... Uh, and now you can see us. Uh, I'm, I was making these little uh, tags from scrap paper. Tutorial is on my... my uh, YouTube, how good they are, you just uh, attach it and you're done. Pocket, 
I just stamped little bit, little scribbles and of course teacup. Scribbles will go all over the journal, like here as well. Uh, this tutorial about these journaling cards are on my Patreon. This book belongs to. This is on cardstock. This is something new to me. I purchased a new cotton fabric. This is thicker cotton. It's not really, really cotton fabric. It is cotton fabric, but in English it's different. It's not, it's not even canvas. It's kind of canvas. I have never had it before. I purchased it and I love it. I want to use that for a journal covers. So inside in a pocket was a journal co uh, card. Uh, this is from original Alice. I was I purchased. I purchased two Alices. Two Alices. One is a uh, like set with um, tags and pages and envelopes, and another one was. Uh, just six journaling cards. So I will put links down below. You can have a look if you are interested. And here I updated a little bit as well with teacup. And inside I just put journaling card. This is from original Alice. Um, I mean original is like from designer paper pad. This journaling card. And then I just put in little to keep in one place these playing cards and these are as well from design uh paper pad so i put them there. so that goes back back in a pocket right and now let's get through all this all this all these houses are put together and on the back as well that's all on my patreon so here we open little like belly band, right? It is on a magnet. But before that, I have some Alice tag hanging down. A little bit of uh, scribbles and um, stenciling. Of course, teacup. So that lifts up. Right. And then we are having a little flip up like that in this flip up i have a journaling card this is grunged up as you can see quite quite heavily right then this one is a pocket which has another journaling card so that, this is all uh card stock so it's quite sturdy and when you turn over this as well, little teapot, some clocks, of course, and little scribbles. So that's place for journaling. And then here, this is a belly band with two journaling cards. This is from completely different, <clears throat> uh, different um, design paper. But because of clock, I put it in. So this is how it looks, just a belly band, right? Some stitching. And rusted fabrics, die cuts, some stamping, some stitching. So all that goes back. This comes down and this goes like that. And tag is hanging down there. Then we go over. Right. Here, what we are having here. We have a little envelope as a pocket with... Is it a tag, some scribbles, and rusted uh, cheese cloth, and and hand dyed <laughs> of uh, fabrics or lace? Another pocket is behind there, which is as well enveloped with a two journaling cards, right? And then behind that envelope is another pocket with two with two journaling cards i left it open because uh, then i can see and then we open all that and then we have hanging a tag with large teapot 
paper thicker i love this right on the back we have some scribbles and stamp for writing pocket here oh this is what i forgot that's what i thought why i have few uh left few journaling cards this meant to be here as a pocket right this is not this is just a sample good i put them in i remembered so two journaling cards here right. some scribbles and coffee these rings a bread stamping um stenciling coffee of course so we close that down and then down there is a journaling space with some scribbles so all that is on a magnet okay then then we are moving like to journaling part kind of i actually wanted to leave this kind of plainish uh but no, didn't work anyway <laughs> uh, collaging and this is um file folder half of file folder with some uh stitching i love how this look really i love this little kind of grungy a simple grunge let's say simple grunge then he as well check paper and was as well ways i put these pages together uh was quite different because i have to have it you know like we have page usually what we do we just fold in a half and we have pay um, pages i couldn't do that here so i had to work as well out how to put pages together to create you know to create signature right some uh collaging here so inking a little bit of fabrics and balls a little bit of scribble and as well here is the same i love how this look very like simple grunge original echo dying i really love how this time came out very bright uh very kind of correct print so that's that then i embellished a little bit of um, alice journaling page which comes from collection of course i added some scribbles and fabrics and and some collaging stamping and um, stenciling again here because i really liked it how that look i put on this as well my country's book page uh grunged up okay it's attached on a fabric another alice embellished extra like embellished with butterflies this is a um decoupage scribbles a little bit of and my uh as well um how do you call it punch all right again here really grunge i love how this look and few uh not embellished pages <laughs> i think these are only two and if you noticed all pages are doubled so there is now i think this book page is just single all the pages as you can see is doubled up so they are all thick and sturdy pages like this one as well look they are all doubled this is not but most of them are doubled that again makes like extra grungy look and gives more sturdiness because of that uh large journal a long envelope as well embellished to allow that cup inside i put in long journaling card as well with this scribbles i love this that's what a good idea <laughs> all right so that goes there another a part of a file folder and again you can see 
just by attaching these little um, tags, it makes a really nice page and just some uh, punch on the side and it's quite fine. I love this woven page. I never did this uh, before. So I left as it is. I did it in Balish. So like that. Another file folded page. So that's sturdy one. So I didn't back them up. This page is a very grungy a scrap page and I attached it to another page so this is attached and another uh, journaling card this is from set and as well rusted kind of um, paper pa uh, clips and how I do that is on my YouTube then center of the journal uh, little tag are uh, some collaging and scribbles and this flips up and scribbles collaging fabrics with some stitching oh this one bent down sorry this believe should be staying like that right like that Uh, some scrap scrap uh, papers put together uh, one butterfly another part of that woven page that as well I do on a you on a Pietro. another page quite, quite a grungy one with Alice I attached it to a file folder page Right, and these are mine, my own stencils. Another part of envelope, and I have three journaling cards in. So these journaling cards I purchased purchased separately. Like that. Um, I was drawing these teacups with flowers, if you remember. So I put in a coffee, and this is how it came out. Quite like it, a little bit blurred. A right, little bit of grunge here. Uh, just a journaling card on a page. And this one as well is doubled. So I uh, just folded it up and, and glued together. Very embellished uh, page. With like everything. Scribbles, um, fabric flowers, a little bit embroidered. A vintage photo, Alice photo, some... Uh, I forgot how to call these scrap clusters. Ah, ha, remember. And as well, it's doubled as you can see, it's lined on there. Uh, my country's book page, very embellished again uh, page. And this is fabric I just doodled on with a bell pen. It's a gel pen. It's a gel pen. So I actually quite like it. That, as that as well, I haven't done it before. My own stamp and scribbles. Right. Another part of, of that um, echo dye. And I love to actually to put together vintage photos and Alice, uh, like pictures from Alice Key. I really like it. Some scribbles and coffee, stamping, collaging. And this one, this leaf, look how that leaf looks here. I love, love, love it. So these leaves as well, actually inspired by Andrea, which is our teammate. But she was doing um, die cuts. And how I did this as well is on my YouTube. So please watch if you're interested. Some scribbles. And now with another part, and this is as well on my Patreon. So I have to, sorry guys, I just will clip it for, for, for not to come back. Right, so this I just open, kind of on a way. And then this is, uh, I open that, that's a flip, but it is a belly band with uh, journaling cards. And with some scribbles, of course. Then we open. 
right uh, I cannot show you let's see All right can you see yeah um two journaling cards All right and space for journaling there as well okay then we have two flips so we flip them up all right and here as well a lot of embellishments and scribbles and these are uh, pictures these two are from designer alice uh, paper pack pocket there and two journaling cards so this is how that look and flips up there is like that with scribbles of course all right as well embellished embellished there so we close it and then we <laughs> nicely tie a little bow to hold it all right and then we are having a last page which is as well from um, or designer paper pad i just cut off that uh, text and that tea time text as well because i was uh, higher and lower down on a designer paper so it didn't fit in so i just i wanted to keep them so i love how this looks so i didn't embellish it at all so this is like a ending page we saying that uh, it's always tea time right and then uh inside of the back cover i have a large pocket very simple as well i put on this uh this thick uh cotton fabric and inside i have a journal right uh from alice like and this is a velcro so i just hold a little bit not to get it off i'm scared and then look what we have here and this i'm making as well on a patron so this journal as well so and this stays in a pocket right so i almost have a dry mouth <laughs> talking you through so, and as you can see, yeah, it was, you know, a little bit of thinking to do, a little bit of work to do, but I actually love how this came out. Something a little bit different, as I normally do, but yeah, I absolutely love it. Okay, so what's next? Next, something small or... Uh, or, or just maybe blank with a little bit of collaging in because uh, this one took <laughs> took a lot of my brain. <laughs> this one took a little bit of work, a little bit of rest after this. So, yeah, but now journals are coming. And if you are interested in to purchase black or these, not black, these dark grungy papers, they as well, they are available on my Etsy. It's a set. If you haven't seen it and video what exactly includes uh i have in this set is on my youtube as well anyway my lovelies thank you so so much for following me back because as you know this is my another new uh channel simply because i locked myself out from my old one and there is no way I can get back. I tried a million times and there is no way. So this is my new one. This is going to be a new one. So please do, uh, write down your password because passwords can mess up a whole your life. <laughs> like mine. But anyway, I have a new one, right? So thank you so much for following me, me back. Have a great week. And if you have any questions, please ask. So you can contact me on Instagram or Etsy. That's kind of more, you know, uh, more amusing. And I can see you are uh, using as well. So my lovelies, thank you so, so much. Thank you for your comments. Thank you for Patreon because 
I have um, quite a lot of people following me from very, very beginning. So that's just, you know, in incredible. I absolutely just, you know, there is not enough thank you for that. So, yeah, I'm quite, I'm fine. <laughs> it's very cold down here. It's like first night of the frost. Uh, so, yeah, I went outside. It's like everything. Grass is white. Right, right, my lovely. Thank you so, so much. And uh, see you very soon. Bye.